Is there a particular ship y'all are wanting to fly with? Uh, typically we fly Hurricane, but uh, if you don't have one, then uh, you're free to bring whatever. Hurricane, Gladiator, Gladiator. Gladiator is kind of hard to fly because of the way it handles, but it it looks so good and it sounds so good in ammo. Yes, <laughs> She's a little on the slower side compared to the bigger ships there, but we can make do. Let me see. I also have a. Um, I got the. What is it called? Oh, actually, I don't. Hold on. Arrow's pretty speedy, too. Yeah, what do you got? Huh, is it just me? We're flying in a straight line, but we're slowly veering off course? Yeah, it's because of the tiny planet and the compass. Because even if we're flying in the same direction, north is going to change slightly. Right, okay. We're going to bank left here to get back on target. Oh, I'm sorry. We need to go the opposite direction. <laughs> Oh great, I'm headless. That's wonderful. Oh no. There's a certain way to fix this, and I don't think it's backspace. I forgot. I think I need to log out, switch servers, and come back. Okay. Hopefully that's all you have to do and not do a full character reset. Yeah. Sometimes change gender. I know for some item bugs that works, but not always. I'll try that too. Load into Arena Commander. They should make like a refresh key like Discord has when it fucks up. Just reloads your character in. Well, that's what the uh, the new character repair is gonna do. Ah, okay. Well, I didn't even know there was a new character repair. Well, it's not out yet, but they're testing it in PTU, so... The, like, uh, character reset is pretty heavy on the server because it has to reset all of your items and... Everything that character repair would do nothing but basically reset your character. Well, yeah, that would be a lot nicer and free up some taxing stuff that. Yeah. I zip up to a higher altitude. Just double check. This would be so cool to like watch from a spectator point of view. It's not really anything that like can do that. Of course, it's like third person view or whatever, but just like floating oh. like, just behind the group or whatever it would be so cool for like cinematic shots. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Done that. It looks amazing. I have a couple hours of footage like that. Oh yeah. If you if you have a YouTube for sure, I was popping in because I saw you guys were doing it to see if you guys had one of those views. But uh... um, I've got a. Yeah, I have. Uh, I used a bit. Yeah. I'm streaming it right now. Yeah, I popped into your Twitch. Check it oh, out. Okay. <clears throat> it's not quite a behind the view or behind the ship view, but. Yeah. 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 Where did you get off to, Steve? Uh, I lost I track of you. I to uh, 40 clicks. I just went up to a high altitude. I just wanted to double check her. Okay. Are you, yeah, let uh, me know if I need to adjust. You guys all racers? Or, uh... Pretty much, yeah. Oh, cool. When's I'm the next, uh, When's the next race? So I can, like, uh... Come check it out. Um, the next official race is going to be whenever PTU goes live. Well, sometime after that. We're, uh, we're waiting on that to happen. No, oh, not anytime soon. Uh, I mean, maybe. Next hey, couple we're weeks, already, maybe. What, yeah, I'm thinking it's going to be pretty soon. 
I mean, everyone thought that on December as well. I no, I didn't. That was like maybe to like the initial. What do they call them? Evocati. Mm. I have my old stuff on line. Really? Oh yeah. man. No, I, I I was well tempered by by Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when I thought it was going to be live for Daymar Rally. I'm like, oh yeah, it'll be out by the end of June. Mm -hmm. That'd have been cool. That'd have been Sweet cool. Summer. But no, I'm thinking like, honestly, I'm thinking March. Oh, this is cool. They're, they're getting closer. Yeah, uh, the PT has been uh, upgrading quite a bit. Yeah. With the last few days. So I think it'll be released next week. Then again, I could have said the same thing last week. <laughs> yeah, it just... Are you all, uh... Sorry, go ahead. I was just gonna... It just depends on whether or not they get any more uh, game-breaking bugs that they've got to fix. Aside from the ones they already yeah. know about. I was gonna ask if y'all were, like, fans of F1 or, like, other racing, like, real-life racing series and stuff like that. Formula One? Yeah. Or like IndyCar yeah. or like NASCAR or whatever. Uh, there's yeah, I've different... watched a few of think... that. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I think everyone here is a bit of a race enthusiast in some form or another. Where the uh, I... one time went to the Red Bull uh, Air Race down in Windsor, Ontario. It was pretty cool. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to uh, help design vehicles for Formula SAE. Oh, um, wow. Well, yeah. fucking two your <laughs> damn horn, bud. Damn, stand up on the box and tell Wait, us that? about it. Um, it's basically like it's not Formula One, but it's like college level Formula oh, One. Oh, I think yeah. I've seen a car that won one of those championships in a in an aerospace museum in Ottawa, on, Ontario. It was like yeah, a that's, university. Yeah, yeah, that was like my field, one. aerospace cool. engineering. So I know about aerodynamics so it's like i was nice. part of the simulation uh, part you know getting the airflow fluid and you know also suspension as well that's what i focused on so did you use yeah. that flow vis paint in wind tunnels they use an f1 they put that bright highlighter color flow vis stuff on to see where the wind goes yeah we did at my university we had a pretty nice wind tunnel so we were using it quite a bit it was Hey, do you see my uh, party marker? I do, yeah. Are you on it? Yeah, I'm on it. So if, you, okay. if you're heading directly at me... Yeah, we are actually so almost sure. perfectly in line. That's why By I like accident. Star Citizen, because it gets very close to... You know, they try to get close to the actual physics of it, and so... And I'm very happy they're going to introduce ailerons and uh, things as such. You know, yeah. lift. That's going to be cool. Will, will scope, scope Creep ever get to the point where you can, like, design your own hall of your racing ship? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Probably <step>. not. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Not in Star Citizen. Oh. It's going to be like a spec series, and the racers are going to be the difference. Yeah. You're going to be able racing. to swap your thrusters and swap all your stuff out. I mean, it it would be cool if if they could uh, work out how to make the tech accessible, but I think the way they build their spaceships is too limited. Mm -hmm. It'll be like F two or something like a spec series where the racers can are the ones that make the difference, kind of thing. We're gonna start nosing down here to get back to level, guys. Let's we'll see where. Just how much gentle do I have. I'll try to rent the ship real quick, and I'll meet you guys. Okay, sounds good. We're still 230 meters or so from the uh, the river. Okay. You flying at uh, Microtech down data? Yeah, Microtech. You want a different mic maze? You sound quiet and kind of muffled. Oh, do I? Uh, maybe yeah, I'm you're really very far away. You sound like you're using a camera or a microphone. Oh. Camera built in, or the microphone in your verbals, or something. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we have what? Yeah, man, it's built into the verbals. <laughs> Hell yeah. Along, along with the uh, 
the contact sensitive pads for your fingers. Yeah. Is this me back don't, to normal? Don't forget nope. about the eye tracking. Nope. <laughs> yeah, the eye tracking on your hat switch. Uh, <laughs> okay, yep. Eyes, eyes on the river. Roger that. Just wanted to triple check. So here, I'll what about back. now? Yeah, hey, yeah that's, that's better. somewhat better, yeah. Now you're back. I just just plugged in my camera, so yeah, it was the webcam. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, shake it off. You doing hurries today? Hurries or gladiators, yeah. I think everybody's oh. flying a hurricane at the moment. Alright, lost guys, here we are. Be nice to see a gladiator out there. Can you rent one of the two in uh, Lorville? I am not sure, actually, if you can rent either. I think you can rent an arrow. I don't think you can rent the others. Uh, let me look that up. You guys want to have a little fun while we're on the way? Let's do a break maneuver. Uh, let me form up. Yeah, I got some travel to do. I'm at our corp. Roger that. <clears throat> uh, what were you saying, Keith? I was saying is, if we start maneuvering, is that not going to stray us from the target? Well, I'll just fly straight. You guys can break off, because you, you can catch back up to me. I'm pretty slow. I'll just keep I flying know. in a straight line. All right, so if, yeah, do a 45 degree roll and a pitch up. No boost. You ready? Yep. Three, two, one, roll. Break. <laughs> That split the party markers. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wondering okay. if you can. I'm wrong about the the speed here. Let me. I'm gonna nose down because I'm doing a thousand. Didn't realize. I wonder if you so could far. use your your G meter to kind of keep turns somewhat in line. You know what I mean? If for a uh, a brake maneuver like that. So if Keith and I were to do that and we say, all right, on your turn, don't exceed more than like an, like a 6G turn, you know, would that keep things decently in line as long as we're both, you know, max speed and I don't know. Uh, maybe what I'd say it depends on your nose position. Oh, like oh shit. Yeah, oh my God. <laughs> oh, I saw that. That was close. Uh, I would say it's probably, it would probably be easier to try to limit it by speed, so you, know, you go into a turn really hard, then say you want to maintain 300 meters a second, so as soon as you got to 300, you would uh, reduce your pitch up angle to maintain 300, and you could combine that with your G reading, so if you know how many Gs you can pull at your particular altitude to maintain that speed, then you could use a combination of the two, but... I would say it's pretty hard at the moment because all the readouts on the HUD are so small. It'd be very yeah. difficult to to be able to like read both of them at the same time. Yeah, I think yeah, speed plus Gs would give you a good sense of your turn rate. I think. Yeah. So that could I actually think so. work if you go. Okay, we're gonna. Because you'd hit that your throttle and, time. and then that would. I mean, yeah. it's worth trying, right? Because you could see, you know, somebody breaks left, somebody breaks right, and you both do a 5G turn, and, you know, when do you get back to right. when do you meet? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, nice. I can get an arrow from the station map. I'm going to do that. Because okay. cause then if you have your, like, uh, like a lead saying, all right, just like how data does bank and then break or whatever it is, you know, as you're turning, 
just kind of nice. talk through it or something. That we. Steve uh, is here, so uh, yeah. Turns. Let's go again. I'm gonna yeah, keep flying straight. Down. So Steve, you go straight up, and then Keith and Max do your. Or monster and Keith do the same thing you did last time. So three. I will go up and over you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Remember, no boost. There we go. Three, two, one. Roll. Break. Nice. That's a six point three at the peak of that turn. Yeah, I, if you look at your angle of attack, once you get to like 20, 30 degrees, you're probably up to like 6 Gs. Yeah, and that's just kind of bury the stick in the gut kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah, there we go, 8 Gs. Yeah, I know oh, we don't have beautiful. Attack, but with the... Beautiful wow, reform, perfect. you guys are right next to each other. Oh, that looked great. A little behind. Yeah, I'm about six click back. Feel like if all right, so Keith, what's your visual cues that you're using? Would you say? Uh, my visual cues. What do you mean? Like so, for me, whenever I'm flying, like, uh, right on leads wing, or just like just doing this in general, one of the things I do is I find a point, like in my ship. And I use that as a reference against Data's ship. So usually, like, I'll use that little box on the top corner, and now I'll put that up. slant just above, you know, the entire hull. Like it outlines the hull, kind of a thing. Right. I don't Do you know what I mean. Or yeah. you know, use like you oh, cover the corner <laughs> Steve. of the <that> box. <laughs> Honestly, I just improvise the entire time, like, I'm not really, really okay. yeah, yeah, I just, yeah. uh, see ground, sky, see data, that's all, that's all I need. Fair, fair. Top thrusters. Yeah, I know, uh, Turkin likes to bury the cockpit of the midship, like, basically line cockpit to cockpit. Mm-hmm. Uh, hide it, I know that kind of works. That way you have like a visual reference of like, okay, I'm too far, too shallow, too high. Oh, there's the river on our left, we just passed it. Like the V hurricane cockpit, because when you're in this pocket, this slot, you kind oh, of yeah. see the V. Right. Alright, let's try a uh, left bank here. I don't remember exactly how the... Uh, Oh yeah, so it doesn't turn very well. All right, so I'm gonna maintain my nose on TVI, which might be a little different than a normal strafe up turn. Heads up, we got a bogey on the screen. That's yeah, probably the NPC ship. ship. Mm-hmm. Oh right, he's down there at the river outpost. <laughs> yep. Uh, oh yeah, he's incoming. You boys want to clear it out yeah. quick? Yep, yep. Let's do it. Light them up, boys. <laughs> I'm stripped, so all I can do is look pretty. All right, he's after you, Ram. Steve. <laughs> I mean, that's good. I'll just dodge. You take him out. Oh, no. I can be bait. I lost a whisker, I just realized. Oh no. I only have what gun. I'll just keep trying spinning, it seems like a good trick. <laughs> my altitude. Engines let him just fall to his death. Oh, dude, that would be so awesome. Have you seen any so uh, soft death ships falling to the ground? It's hilarious. 
I only oh, there it goes. Was, it was a, it was a cutlass Ooh. with the AI in the back, the reinforcement one, and I saw yeah. through the door all the AI were tumbling and ragdolling inside. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Oh, wrong. I wish I could have seen that. <sighs> Oh, he's spinning, he's spinning. I think he's got a death spin. Uh, is he gonna pull it? Oh, he pulled it out. No. Nope. Major torque imbalance. Oh yeah, here he goes, here he goes. Is he going down? I can't tell if he's just spinning in place. Oh, he's dead. Oh, get down. There he goes. Now, if only with that would just go all the way down. Right. <laughs> I'm surprised he actually fell all the way to the ground and hit. That doesn't usually happen in, just, uh, like, PU. In yeah. yeah. Alright, I've completely lost track of the river. I think it's on our left. Oh, those are trees. Hill, hill, hill. <laughs> I was like, oh man, I thought he was going to lose it. I look back just in time. Rain. Right side. Right. Yeah, Copy that. Rolling right. Oh, that's a sharp roll. I was oh, actually right, right, thinking right. for... Here, I'll take left, monster. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, no, sorry, I mean, I'll, I'll take your left, you're fine. Maybe. Oh. I mean... Ooh, I get you. Oh, shit. Out. We're getting low. <laughs> <laughs> oh, genius. Oh, no. Monster down. <laughs> yeah, I'll take middle then. Well, Aldios, if you uh, are up there, Tressler, Monster is going to be backed up in a second. He can spawn you uh, a hurricane if you want to fly that. Oh, well, that sounds cool. Nice. Yeah, I'll decide later now. Roger that. Yeah, I kind of like flying with the Valkyrie. It's not it's not so big like a Hercules, but it's big enough to be that like smooth. Yeah. Smooth big shot. All right, you guys See, want to try something I... a little bit dangerous? Like yeah. I have one hurricane. Let's go. Engines off. Engines well, off. no, follow follow the leader. Follow the hur or the uh, the uh, the Valkyrie through the river. It's probably a bad plan to do this this early. <laughs> I have no chance I can barely even stand straight. Well, it would have to be follow the leader, so single file. There's no way you're going to yeah. fly formation through there. Oh, I'll go Wait. on a straight line. <laughs> side by side. <laughs> Let's see, did we miss the river? Yeah, we just passed it. It's on our left. Okay. Or behind. Yeah. Behind left now. The turn radius on this thing is very low if you're using only strafe up. But in some ways it, it feels more realistic. So that's something I want to try at some point if we do uh, see how well the hurricanes can do in formation without strafe up. Just see if uh, it's controllable. Like that could be a good speed for passes or something. You're, right, right. You'll probably be nose up, you know, 10, 15 degrees. No, I think more like 7 degrees should do it. Well, we can try that right now. I'm going to level out. I am a little bit curious to see if the uh, the Valkyrie can do it. So I am going to let off, strafe up, and then try to maintain altitude with just no pitch up. Oh, yeah. Oh, Valkyrie yeah, is not bad. It's, it's slow, but... Oh, but the, yeah, I think hurricanes will have trouble matching you. Well, actually. Oh, 
something like this seems better. That's actually not that bad. Reverse helicopter. Yeah. Probably have to go, if we're going full speed, it's probably less of an up angle, but that's, that's not awful. Yeah. It's a bit easier because I don't have to keep rest. Oh, I'm dropping like a rock. <laughs> yeah, you gotta watch where we're going. It's, I gotta maintain about a wow. 10 to 15% pitch up to uh, stay level. Here, Keith, let's try it in Levath. Maybe let's try full speed. Yeah, go full speed, see what happens. Oh, the tree is almost... Can't wait for it. Here, Keith, why don't you go full speed, I'll, I'll match you. Alright, data's breaking off. Okay, going under you, data. <laughs> Alright, letting off straight up. Just gonna boost to catch up. Okay, just entered Armistice Zone of Tesla Spaceport. I'm going 374 right now. 359. Yeah, you're, you're burning on me. I'm like 305 maybe. Yeah. I'm, I'm going 379. Are you using uh, strafe up? What thing? Uh, uh slightly. slightly. Huh. Oh, if he's using any strafe up, that's going to be a, a pretty big difference in speed. Because uh, yeah. right, yeah. no, I'll, I'll let go, I'll of, let go strafe of strafe up. It immediately went down, down to like 300. 300. Okay. Yeah. Let me just check. Just ask your speech and speed. That should do it. Two. Ooh. Two sixty. Two six. It's a major difference. Nah, yeah, it looks. I'm just gonna see if I can try to be in formation with you. It looks like about ten degrees on the ladder. Yeah, yeah something, something like that. that. Oh, I have to actually yaw. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> Like yeah, I'm going degrees. 267 and going up slightly. Yeah, I'm using more flat planet to be able to test this out properly. Okay, I'm here at the station. Uh, just let me know what hanging gradient to go to. I'm um, still 8. Uh, Let's set break. your spawn before. Uh, oh, that's probably smart. Yeah. It's actually not too hard to stay in formation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's quite smoothly. It's just that the 10 degree angle is a bit uh, annoying. Yeah. No, it totally is. just feels unnatural. Yeah, it's like coming in for a landing angle. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> oh, Steve, you are quite close to the trees there. Yeah, I thought this could be like, a, you know, past the crowd, everybody has the same nose up, and then you kind of stay in a tight formation. Yeah, probably not for like general flying, but then the nah. speed 270. Yeah, I wouldn't rely on this for formation flying at all. No, <laughs> it would be so confusing. It would be pretty. Yeah, but you know, pretty wait. squirrely. Like that time. Yeah, I was wondering if maybe it'd be a little less bouncy. Uh, but yeah, you got to use so much pitch and throttle to maintain. It's pretty tough. On the bright side, at least, at least your uh, wrist is not strained. Yeah, right. Okay, right, I yeah, think I'll... pretty much on your wing. Yeah, let's, shall we head back? Yeah, I'll find a plate. 
<laughs> I'll find a place to refuel. Um, yeah. Did you blow up? I am fine. No, you're both but okay. You bounced. <laughs> and oh, no. of course, I, I hit the ground. <laughs> so I don't blow up by hitting somebody. I blow up by hitting the ground. <laughs> Good thing to note. Alright, Hangar 4. You're gonna refuel? Yeah. Hangar 4. Alright. And then let me know when you're out of armistice. Alright. Maybe SMO 22 or New Babbage are probably the only. Or, I mean, or uh, Everest. Data, how are you doing on fuel? I am about 50%. I think I'm a little under 50 now. Oh, I'm going to so SMO wasting. Okay. I just had to Tressler and then I'll zip back to you, Data. Roger. Hey guys, didn't want to interrupt. interrupt. <laughs> how can I guys join you? Uh, what was the question? How could join you guys? Uh, let's see, who's that talking? Shredo. Oh, Shredo. Hey, um. Let's see. I'm not sure I've got you on my friends list. Um, uh, are you still in menu? No, but I can drop out. Give me a second. Oh, oops, wrong button. Yeah, For sure, you did it. get a party invite. Roger that. Sorry, Maze. <laughs> no, you're fine. Party invite sent. I've just yeah, been traveling. I do not have you on my list, so if you'll send data machine no underscore a friend invite, then I'll get you into the party. Copy that. Oh. Apparently, I already sent you an invite. Uh, you sent me a friend request? Yeah. No. Oh. I don't see it. Send me another one. Who am I, I jumping to? Are you on PTU or PU? Oh, we're on PU, not PTU. Ah, uh, to that's a problem. data machine, I think, means. Data hey, machine's down at the river. Wow, this thing flies weird. What, the hurricane? They glide. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, so, yeah, Gladiator is uh, more like an aeroplane. So you actually cannot pitch or yaw off of the, the TVI. You basically have to control TVI with, um, with strength and main thrusters. Like, pitching Got up it. will not change your... Uh, your rate of turn at all, it'll just uh, slow you down because you're creating drag. Interesting. Yeah, it is very different than just about every other ship, I think. Alright, Data, on your wing. Roger that. I'll be rejoining in a minute. I've been playing with the increased FOV and the uh, PTU. Uh, so I good, yeah. I like it. Oh, you don't no, like it? Mm. It's it's too much. I think it's too much. Personally, everything gets too small, you know. Yeah, but the scaling is better for like just regular FOV, right? I don't know. I'm on an ultra ride, so I feel like 
I might already have. Are you on an ultra wide or a 16 by 9? I'm on an ultra wide. Right, so you prefer to, what is it, 130? Horizontal. No, I did. I don't have it at 130. I think I think I was. I had it at like 115. 115 is is the current max. Yeah. But it changes depending on your monitor, though. And your resolution, but it feels like it, like just the UI is scaled a little better in PTU. I could be wrong. Yeah, so I'm currently on 115 FOV, and I tried increasing that into PTU, and I found it to just warp a little bit too much. I'm on your right wing. Roger. I, I thought I was going to really like it, but... Yeah. It's a little too fish-eyed was... for me. I think I kicked it to 100. Yeah. And I like it better than 90 inches. Is that 16 by 9, or...? Yeah, I'm on 16 by 9. So it's nice. Raj. Yeah, I gotcha. I, I thought I was going to like the sense of speed change, but yeah, I, find it, I found it a little too much. So what have you guys been up to? Uh, just cruising. We flew over here to the river from uh, New Babbage. Other than that, we haven't really been doing much. Raj. Uh, Steve tried uh, a no strafe up, uh, just pitch up. Uh, test to see how fast and how viable that is for the uh, hurricane. Yeah, definitely hard to stay in formation. <laughs> yeah. Just pitch you on throttle, and it ended up being a little bouncier. I thought maybe it'd be less bouncy. And then you're yeah. you're at a 10 degree pitch up rate, so you're a little scrambled. Are we leaving you behind, Alios? Can you keep up with us now? Oh yeah, I was just missing with a speed limiter. That's why. Oh, but okay. I can keep up. I'll try it. I'm gonna do it on your wing data. I'm gonna Roger. slowly start. Oh, and it's it's even harder at this speed, at max speed in the hurricane, you're only at like ten percent. But yeah, at this speed you're gonna be at like twenty thirty. Because you gotta <laughs> throttle down to do it. It's, it's not too bad, look at that. It works alright. It it looks more up. interesting because you're you like got some wobble like you would expect uh, an aircraft to have at lower speed. So we're not going lower speed, but... Yeah, the interesting thing is I'm wobbling up and down, right, because I'm doing it with pitch. It's pretty cool. A little bit, yeah, but I can see, like, you rolling side to side, too. Just making yeah. small course corrections. It looks cool. Yeah, it's because when you pitch, you kind of get offset and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you're using and, pitch, too. Well, mind you, I, I guess what I'm doing without even realizing now is I wasn't doing strafe. So I started rolling as well instead of strafing. Right. <laughs> it's kind of like my brain is doing either either everything or nothing, I guess. It's like now I'm an airplane. Yeah. It's nice though, it feels good. I'm a control service. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Feels a little, I don't know, smooth. Yeah. I bet the transition looks cool from a third person. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I'm looking like third person. It looks super cool. Oh, look at this. We got ships coming in all over the place. Hey, I'm joining you back. Beautiful. So what's with the Valkyrie? I just wanted to change it up a little bit. Give a, a more stable nice. platform. Yeah, it's nice. I love the Valkyrie, man. Ever since you took it out for that video, so yeah, I it. <laughs> we're all Anvil out here Valkyrie today. And Terrapin, though, I like Terrapin too. I need to. They just do look a like proper check. VTOL spaceships, you know. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're gonna do a left turn here, starting now. I love the whistle of the uh, hurricane. Yeah. Or is that the Valkyrie? Uh, the Valkyrie doesn't have much whistle, I don't think. At least not in uh, first person. Right. Yeah, I think it's the Hurricane. At some point, I'll yeah. isolate the frequency and see if I can. Um, it might be the Gladiator, which is behind you on your left. Or on your right, I mean, saying. sorry. Gladiator has really, really good atmospheric right. audio. I still feel like it's you, to be honest. 
It might be, yeah. Like a third person uh, audio effect. It, it seems, it's, yeah, I don't know. I feel like I haven't, I don't usually hear it, so I think it's you. Only one way to find out, cut engines. Just not now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, by the way, Data, uh, turns out I have the elephant in the PU. Okay, right, right. Um, data is going to break off. I'm rolling and going down. What's happening? I'm breaking off. <laughs> oh, I'm following. That's amazing. <laughs> Just like, <laughs> I'm still here. <laughs> All right. I got confused. Hang on, I was trying to record, but my, my record button isn't working. I'm gonna sit down here so I can set a party invite. Control one. Slowing down. Preparing for landing. Yeah, now that I'm not information, I cannot hear it. So I think it was the. Uh, I think it was you, Data. Yeah, it could have been. Landing gear deployed. Oh, it's the pitch of the hurricane. That's the noise. We were in a turn. Ah, uh, And right. the pitch rate goes... Oh, sorry, that's a really nice sound. Is there a tree in front of me? Yep, that's a tree. Negative. Like a stump. But yeah, you're good. Oh, okay. <laughs> Negative. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see no tree. I'm in front of you. <laughs> it's half a tree. <laughs> Amazing three landing gear. We don't need right. no landing gear. Yeah. Pardon me, Vice Centrado. It's like a boat on the bottom. Got you know, it. Just rested yeah, in the snow. Landing gear is for plebs. <laughs> I want to take the Mustang take out some more. Off, though. Yeah. Got to take the Mustang out and land it on the skids. Nice. Yeah, the old, old Mustang, it only had the skids, and then people would break their wings off and couldn't land, so they added the whole wing-folding landing gear thing and redid it, but the old, old one was just a skid lander. That's gorgeous. Like Pretty the, cool. like the Razor? Examples. Skids like that? No, like uh, the wingtips. Like a helicopter. Oh, wow. Just land right on the wings. Who's, doing, uh, 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 the, the launch, uh... Oh. <laughs> That's monster. Yeah. It's going for a, a main engine VTOL. Woo, there you go. Oh, <laughs> wow, that was close. <laughs> wow. I'm kind of curious if I can make this look good on the uh, Valkyrie. I'm not sure I can. Landing gear raised. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you timed it. Matched your pitch rate with the engines. So, Data, we we going off again? Yeah, I actually need to go get some fuel. I'm about twenty five percent. I was going to take you back to the river, but I have lost it. It's around here somewhere. If you guys want to just chill out. For a second, I'm gonna go grab some fuel and I'll QT back to you. Roger, I'm I'm staying on your wing for a while. All right, I'm boosting up. I don't need no clouds. boost. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I'm still probably 100 meters below your max speed. Interesting how your main engines are basically torching your own wings. Yeah, I know. All right, boosters are running out. I'm slowing down. God, that is one hell of a change in speed. It's all—it's like no momentum is is kept either. It's like straight away. I, if you look at the lineup. Speed. They they actually did get the uh, the engine like where they're pointed yeah, in a way that enough, it's not but hitting but yeah 
sort of. The, the front engine top one is pretty damn close. Yeah. All Steve, right, you got it. Out here. Roger. I'm gonna park at the lake and be a few people. Nice pull away. Ah, uh, there she is. Yeah, it's a good size, not too big, not too small. It's like a I'm coming I don't, for maybe I was speed, looking, Steve. I was looking at your GIFs and I was like, what's a, what's a ship that's like a little bit bigger than the Hurricane, but not too much bigger, so... Someone found a river? Oh, yeah, running through it. Can't resist. <laughs> Excellent, no, this is great. I haven't been back here in a while. It look, I mean, it looks this a lot This is gonna be interesting. I'm expecting some explosions. Shortcut. Oh man, I can't see anything with your, with your water vapor. Splashes. This is a tight one. Sure, do. I've got a gladiator or a, a hurricane if you'd like to fly either of those. I forgot what you guys had to contest with with the uh, the racing here with the, all the splash. Yeah, it's rough if you're in like third place, close in. Yeah. Well, even now, oh, just somebody died. Steve. Yeah, died. Somebody popped. Well, I, it's rough. I, I guess that did look tasty. Ah, uh, this turn. Please proceed to assign landing. I really like that format of go down and then go back again. Uh, oh. No. Speed ran that race at the snake pit. It was just chaos. I'm alive. Like it was Dirk's event. What do you mean, Steve? Uh, like we did with the river race, you run it down and then you do it in reverse. Oh, nice. Yeah. So How that was, was fun at the snake pit. Uh, it was pretty good. It was uh, a lot of razors passing real close, but that's cool. I completely forgot about it. Yeah, it was fun. I think Speed did a recap. Nice. One of these turns is tight after the straight. Yep, this one. That's the killer. And then up the hill. See this right here. I had to bank that. Oh, oh Steve! Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, grabbed a tree. Oh, You're no. Good. You're good. He You're good. saved <laughs> it. You even have all your wings. Everything is still there. Wow. I'm missing a wing. Uh-oh. Still flying in here, though. And then you run out of trees. I still got to see the canyon one in the PTU, the Canyon River, but... Yeah, oh, yeah that looks pretty cool. cool. Yeah. It's this one's pretty nice. much the same, but the, the cliffs uh, close in that bit right at the top there. Quick question. I, I was racing. Specific ships? What was that? What? Gladiator or Hurricane, right? Those. Yeah, that's what we're in. Shredo, I'm oh, here at the uh, the okay. station, so if you'd like to fly either of those, I've got an extra you can have. <laughs> I have, an, uh, I have a hurricane. It's going to okay. be here in 20 seconds. Yeah, if you're missing a wing, though, you might want to get her all fixed up before we start oh, again. Who needs an extra wing when you got a million and one control services? <laughs> yeah, but I'll get this repaired, don't worry. <laughs> yeah, I've got a hole in my right wing. Okay, right, let's see. The treetop. It's something I wish, you know. The ship just should go through the trees, you know. Unobtainium trees. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bud. What's the uh, minimum jumpable range again from altitude wise? I think it's 12,000. 10, 10 and a half? 10 and 12, a half, 12. 000. Something like that. Okay. Thank you. Please 
landing gear deployed. I'm going low. Oh, you're up there. Nice. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool that river is going into AC. Good thing you said that because I don't have a marker for you. The water looks gorgeous. Did they change how the water reflects here? It's definitely different in PTU. I don't know if it's any different in this one. But it up looks close, you really get better. it. some of that Gen 12 stuff they did. Oh, shit! Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> Couldn't stop live? it in time. I QT'd one of you guys. I had the line of sight, but it threw me through the planet anyway. No, oh, no. Oh. I hate when it happens. It's, it's like, oh, it seems a little reliable. And then it's like, zoop. Yeah. <laughs> Works 90% of the time. That's the worst. <laughs> yeah. All right, so I'm going to head out to not today. All right, Lovas. All right, see you, Lovas. Take it easy. I'll stay longer uh, next time. All right, Sounds all good. good, man. All right, monster, who's chasing who? Oh. Hello. Oh. Hello. I don't know. Am I gonna chase you? You're gonna chase me? Welcome. Oh shit, through the river, I see what you're saying. I mean, yeah, where else? Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Dude's gonna get me killed is what it is. <laughs> shit, I don't even see, yeah, your dust effects, I can't even see the river. Alright, she's prepared. Freshly repaired. Yeah, I never did the uh, original river racing, so I don't know this thing too fun. terribly well. Honestly, I don't th think there were many of us that really knew it very well either. We were all flying by the seat of our pants. Yeah, it was really fun. Everybody, <clears throat> everyone's. Oh, oh no, I my game crashed. God damn it! Oh. Well, you're still in the air. Not for long, I bet. I was oh, 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 there he is going down. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I'm still, still, even without XMP in my memory, running into crashes with Star Citizen. Have you looked at the uh, the crash file to see if it's... Uh... I'm just looking now. Yeah, I'm just having another look here. Was it the game.log? Which one was it again? Yeah. Game.log. Crash handler. Yeah, so it's still exception excess violation. So it's still a memory thing. Thank you. And please visit again. Well, well if you've got though. some time, you could run a uh, memtest86 for a couple hours and see if that comes up with any errors. You just won't be able to right. do anything else in your machine because it runs that outside the OS. I wouldn't even know where to start with something like that. Um, it's pretty simple. Um, just Google it and it's got the program and then all the instructions you need to run it. You said memtest86? Mm-hmm. 
I don't know if that's what it's still called. I haven't run it, used it in in a while. I will do that. Um, tonight. It's like later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll just do it when I go to bed. Did I end up dying? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, you <laughs> got a beautiful final resting place there. It was quite nice. Beautiful trees, river nearby. You've got and Diplo the and there's the trees on the bank across from you. <laughs> yeah, nice. Oh! Oh, oh there's a... Uh, oh. See bouncing. Alios, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. There was a collision. Let's see. It hit the top side, but none of my wings are missing. Keith, are you okay? <laughs> no. Those <laughs> trees <laughs> 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 came out of nowhere. <laughs> One of you is transmitting on party. Uh, let's see. I think Jeez. I'm good. Alios, you look okay. Uh, shall we form up? Or I know we got a couple back at Everest, but or Tressler. Well, oh, if we keep doing this river thing, we're gonna constantly have someone back at yeah. Everest. I think. <laughs> so yeah, let's. Uh... We got two gladiators. Yeah, data switched over. Maze, you got a gladiator. Uh, I do, yes. Maybe we can do like a three and three. Yes, uh, roger that. Yeah, I think what happened there, like I found a tight turn and I had to get out the line real quick. And as soon as it came out, out the trees, there he was. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I think oh, my game man. just crashed. Yeah, my game just crashed too. One of the thing about the river. <laughs> so, I just I'm wondering, is it even an issue on my part that I crashed, or is it just? I think it's just three seventeen. Yeah, Keith, yeah maybe something all right? with the river and the graphics. Yep. Anybody have eyes on Data Machine? Uh, not at all. Uh, yep. Splash. <laughs> oh, yeah. splash. You uh. Oh. Your body went through the planet. I tried to hit coupled right before the game went all the way out, but it was too late. Nah, yeah, you hit trees. One of those times when that happens, if I'm close enough to someone, I want to try to catch their ship <laughs> before yeah. it hits. <laughs> Man, I, I hope to make, make the tree swoop it up there. just like as gentle as you can. I remember there was a time where you can pretty much them. like hide in the trees. I think when was when uh, New Babbage first came out, the Microtech first came out. But I think they got rid of the vegetation a little bit because uh, it was a little impactful on the server. I think they'll add it back in later though. All right. Well, if. It's two people crashing by the river. I'm going to just blame the river on that one. Uh, why don't we start chasing Dang the sun? river. We'll head at about... Yeah, Black Mace is west. in space. Yeah, Data is in space also. Oh, I just respawned. Okay. Yeah, I'm in the gladiator now. Um, Steve, am I just jumping toward you, or...? Yeah, I guess if you up to us we're heading west i'm just gonna go slow while folks form up roger it's gonna do about 150. face some sun
What's your heading, Steve? Uh, but due west ish. Roger. Slate. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Your insurance claim has been sent. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Oh man, the gladiator really doesn't like to pitch, huh? If you don't add anything. You cannot nope. uh, control your TVI at all with pitch. It's all strafe. Pitch will not that increase or decrease it. Yeah. It just wobbles. Who's this that just got in the elevator with me? A random? I guess it's a random. A stowaway. Let's throttle us up. Do it now. Let's hit about 250. I'm going to unlock the ship and see if they get in. I've got a random getting in my turret. What is happening right now? Nice. Well, maybe yeah, not, because I've got some... guns. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Let's see if he plays nice. I'm going to take... Uh, Steve's left wing. Is that okay, Alios? Yeah. Then how's that speed on the gladiator? 250. Uh, so. we're, we're gonna find out. I'm boosting right now. Uh, it's perfect. It's fine. Uh, if we want, kind of shuffle things around. Let's see. We got four here, right? So we could have gladiators on the wings, and then. Hurricanes, front and center. Let's see, so... Alios, you wanna swap with me? Got it. Alright. Is that monster gonna... stalking? Yep. Swap okay. and... Gonna break. Let's see... Oh, Keith, I didn't even see that he was already in the slot. Cool. <laughs> So yeah, so, so Alios, you will want to slot into Steve's right wing there. See what this looks like. Speed limiter just right. Difficult. Yeah, trying to match speed with the limiter is not ideal. That's pretty tough. What do y'all use decoupled? Or yeah, yeah, we're we're all mostly dual stick, so we just use decoupled and. Uh, yeah, what's your input controls? I have uh, two uh, verbal alphas. Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. okay. He can hang, he can hang, he just needs to land the decoupled stuff. Actually looks pretty sick. I like the contrast there. Digging it, digging it. The hurricane, yeah, yeah. gladiators. gladiators. Like yeah, that. very nice. One day we're gonna have to do something about skins. 
Alios, I'm uh, like forming that. up on your right side. Carve it up. Shall we take it down to the ice? A firm. Put it at like five degrees down or so. <laughs> Passengers getting a good, uh, a good view. That's awesome. Oh, I forgot that you had a yeah, stowaway. Yeah, he's still in the turret. That's gorgeous, man. I like that. Start pulling up. Oh, Alios, you're uh, right at the sun. A little bad. bit of lag. No, it's alright. Your position is just kind of bouncing around a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting I used to it. It's it. a little training on my hand as well. I need to get used to this fine controlling. Mm. Gonna level out probably. Oh, I think I just crashed. Uh oh. 17. Rip, don't follow me into the oh, ice. Oh, you're descending. Oh, you're gonna yeah. crash land, dude. You're gonna get the smoothest crash Catch him. Oh my. If oh, he no, get there he goes. Oh. 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 <laughs> you're, still alive. Sick, you're, 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 you're still alive. You're still alive. I think, oh no! I think Keith smashed into you. Oh no! Now you're dead. <laughs> that was sick, right, though. So. <laughs> All right, who? Data. Roger. I'm heading back towards the group. I'll have to check your stream for that data. Taking data's left wing. Alright, passing oh. the group high on the right now. <laughs> I saw that jump. Staying on your left, staying on your left. Roger that. Uh, I guess I need to... Well, I guess I don't need to limit myself much, do I? You do. At least a uh, nudge anyway. Roger that. Just to give me that little bit. Oh, right, because you're in a glad also. Or somebody is. Yeah, we've. that's me on your left in a glad, and we have another one. Roger. I am going to be right behind you. Every time something goes perfect, something breaks. <laughs> That's right. Dude, Dude now, now I want the gladiator. gladiator. That looks so, so cool. cool. Yeah, I don't fly this that much, but it's actually pretty cool. Different, yeah, you know, like you said, pitch-wise. Alright, I'm bringing us down low. Trying to maintain this with altitude because I I've got no. It's hard for me to tell how high I am based on visual reference. Sixteen. Do y'all use uh, the limiter a little bit uh, with the decouple or no? So the only limiter that I use is the acceleration limiter, which will which controls how much thrust is uh, going to your thrusters or how much Ooh, power is going to thrusters. I just feel it more naturally coming, just going, you know, vanilla, no limiters on that thing. Data, have you noticed with the GLAD, you're pitched down on TVI, you'd have to pitch up to keep it on TVI, and that's really strange, and you bleed a whole bunch of speed? Uh, uh, no. Like, no, like never right mind. now? It's because I have you targeted. Look in front, look in front, pill up. I see, I see, I see, I <laughs> see. Oh, oh, someone didn't see. Didn't. <laughs> I didn't even touch that iceberg. What the fuck? <laughs> I was way above no, it. So, just to rectify data, I had you targeted, so my crosshair uh -huh. was nudged. Oh, uh, right. Is that that ESP though? Negative. No, it's just a, this. This gun has this ship has gimbals installed, so if you have someone targeted and they're really close, the the crosshair goes kind of weird. Interesting. Okay, I'm forming back right of Black Maze. Uh, Maz. I don't know how to pronounce it correctly. Yeah, it's yeah, Maze. Black Maze, that's right. Or Maze. Cool. 
We're gonna Joey, climb just a little bit to clear these rocks. All right, when we get to the other side of this mountain, we're gonna do a gentle left turn. I'll call it out. Left, left. Yeah, left, left. <laughs> <laughs> All right, starting to roll now. Today. I gotta head out, but this is good. Uh, Until next week. See you right next time, on. Steve. Yeah, Steve. thanks for flying with us, Steve. <laughs> yeah, anytime. Good fun. All right, see y'all. See ya. See you. This turret dude, I mean, he's. I hope he's taking screenshots. Right, he's scanning. I don't know what he's doing. He's just yeah, <laughs> going in circles. <laughs> Honestly, I'm impressed he hasn't shot anything yet. Nice. I am too. Yeah. I was surprised that he even got in the ship. All right, rolling level, and. Just we're going to maintain our descent. Actually, we're going to... Let's let's roll right and try to follow this valley. And I forgot how... How tight this gladiator sticks to the TVI. It's like glue. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. It's nice. You just can't use right stick, I guess. Yeah, it's basically all left stick and uh, strafe up. Yeah, my memory of the ship is a lot worse, you remember? I, I thought mm -hmm. it was all wonky, but it's pretty damn stable. That dude's still going in circles, I don't know. What I see him, yeah, I don't know. I had chat open, but I didn't notice him saying anything. We're going to start rolling level now. That's felt good. Gotta say, the gladiator is real nice. I wish it didn't have those wingtips angling down. But for the rest, I really like it. I wish it was just oh. like normal wings. Oh yeah, I see I what you're saying. I think it's pretty, and like, I think it's an iconic look, and you get like a really interesting silhouette with it. Yeah, it's true. It's unique. I would, I, I would I be okay with it if they weren't so thick and they weren't like angled. Yeah. Well, end? I think it might just be because they're so thick. It's a really strange look. I love that the yeah. the tail, though. The upper tail matches the hurricane. Ah. I think it's interesting that the, uh, the V... T no, not the V tail. The maneuvering thrusters, they wobble around like... Uh, yeah. It's party time. Yeah, they're... Uh, the hornets are the same. It's party time. Boop, 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 boop. Oh damn! You guys are keeping it really tight. That's so good. That's what we do, man. Oh! Oh! oh. You <laughs> have to say that something. Timing. <laughs> that timing, man, that was just an instant pop. Uh, huh. There was no uh, like little nudge. No, no bump, nudge. No, no bump. bump. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's hilarious. <laughs> the timing of that. Uh, Look how tight down. that is. It's I'm amazing. Landing. Oh man, that was funny. That that's the way it goes with us, right? <laughs> mm. Just had to say it. Some would say commentator's curse. Uh, let's that's see if this guy it. gives you a crime stat. Hopefully, he doesn't. Fly in the shake. Yep, I got one. Oh Welcome damn. To the ASOC <laughs> retrieval system. Damn, level two for real? Really? Only level two? <laughs> I mean that that was homicide, so it, technically it'd be a level three. I'm surprised it only gave you a level two. I think this is the guy at the terminal here. Like the hell, man. The one that's clipping into me right now. I think you might be invisible. Hurston, the Hurston uh, stuff. 
Uh, where did you put it? Uh, on YouTube. <laughs> oh, I may not have. I'm. Um, was it recent? It was the. Uh, no, it was a couple of weeks ago, three weeks ago. It was the. Um, remember you said that they added a bunch of extra life in Hurston. You know the robot that cars drive in and lift and the cargo containers. Oh yeah, yeah, I did see that. Yeah. Yeah, turned it into a pretty. So my inventory mouse is broken. It won't move. Oh, dude, the comedic timing on that crash with monster is so funny. Huh, I've never seen this bug before. When I open the inventory screen, I get a crosshair that's gently drifting to the side and I can't move the mouse. Mm. I'm gonna have to menu and come back, I think. Yeah. Can't believe you gave me a crime stand. What an <laughs> asshole. <laughs> I don't want to pay this off. Uh, depends on what it is. If you want to play it up at the station, go to the Galleria and find the admin terminal or the admin, oh, admin. room. Yeah, and it's the the terminal should be right outside it. Admin, bingo. Man, this thing pitch doesn't work for anything. That's crazy. Yeah, the only way you can change it is with boost and by slowing down. Yeah. Crazy. Jesus, that's almost a million credits. What was the charge? Um, uh, infraction. You have no outstanding fine. Oh wait, total fines is zero. What? That's yeah, not so right. it's it was probably. Uh, oh well. Did y'all hear that? It's like I an after. It's like an aftershock after you shoot the missile. Like oh, when it hits the ground, the yeah, the uh, the atmospheric explosion sound has an echo to it. That's very cool. Very nice. Oh man, I don't know how to switch missile types. I don't think Welcome I'm bound to that. The vehicle retrieval system. Yeah, I'm still. I just got these. I'm trying to bind everything. I think selected. missiles have lost in me to bind. Your has it's been, been like to the freaking location. five hours making sure everything was right. Oh, are these brand new sticks? Yeah, I just got these. Uh, I oh, I had nice. the um, I went from T sixteen hundred, then I got like the Constellation what Delta, what the CM three throttle, and then I decided I want my dual throttle back. And so <laughs> I went with the Alphas. <laughs> Shoot. Nice. I, I feel like you get a lot more precision with the uh, tool sticks. I don't know. Yeah, I think you do. You get one more axes too, right? Hell yeah, you do. Yep. Or actually, you get uh, two more because you get the pinky lever. Yeah. The one thing I really like about it is you can hit the. Uh, you can create uh, what is it? Alternator. So I I put the up trigger where you flip it up as a. Uh, shift like alternator so I could double oh nice yeah that's pretty cool hmm how long before uh, since your wings black nice who knows
Oh, I hit something. Sorry, Keith. Oh, that's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> and having uh, gunners in all of your ships would be pretty crazy. You would not want to miss a boost. Yeah, uh, a four flight of hurricanes with gunners would, would shred just about everything that's in the game right now. At least in uh, this patch. It might be different in uh, 3.18. Nah, not really. At least if it uh, stays the same as it is now on PTU. Put ballistics on it. Hello, Conch. Hello. I'm waiting for my uh, hurricane and I'm pretty sure that dude is, he's just like hovering right over me. <laughs> like, no, no dude. Let's go again. Yeah, he keeps sending me party invites. Like dude, you said, you oh, hate that one. Drive set. Screw you dude. <laughs> Where are you flying right now? We are kind of out in the middle of nowhere on Microtech. Microtech, okay. Could I get a party invite? I joined on your server. Uh, yeah. One second. Let me land. Landing gear deployed. <clears throat> invite sent. Thank you. Ow! Oh, How many shields? <laughs> Sorry. Wait, you don't? <laughs> no. No shields, oh, no my weapons. Screen is just... Oh wait, a black has shields. Yeah, black yes, mage does. No da data machine does not. Oh, you gave me a torque imbalance with just those few shots. Oh wow! It must have hit me right oh, on the engine. Chasing you from behind. Yeah. It does look very cool, the silhouette, even with the wing flip, uh, wing dips dipping down. Be right back. Yeah, this thing feels very much like a fighter jet. The way it handles. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. I'll say though, Data, like even just now, I was shooting at the rock, right, orbiting it, and mm -hmm. just throwing rounds at the rocks. It's really interesting how, with the limited rotation rate and the arrow resistance, kind of stopping this ship very quickly, right? If you are too fast, you can't yaw or pitch. Yeah. It means time on target is like reduced because you can't like get your crosshair on target unless you slow right. down and like set yourself up properly. Uh huh. It's such a awesome way to balance and then the boost just kind of ruins that doesn't it yeah dudes in, set in chat saying let me borrow a ship data machine <laughs> I'm gonna fly underneath and behind data Alright, I'm gonna orient us over there to the sun so we can get a good shot of the sunset. Rolling out now. Trying to stay below you so our paths aren't on the same height. Right. Oh, I'm getting massive uh, dust effect off your ship. <laughs> oh, that's cool. 
Uh, who's got their gear down back there? Oh, that's me. Hang oh, straight out. Okay. <laughs> I have to say, I do like to look at this ship better without the guns on the turret. The bubble's a little yeah. weird, but it doesn't stand out as much. Still kind of strange, yeah. but... Where are we going? Uh... Yeah. Try to get back towards the sun. I didn't mean to climb this much. I was looking at third person. Oh, it's good, though. Gives us a bit of speed. Let's start nosing down a little bit now. <laughs> that looks like you sh or it looks like me shooting. This thing can run guns for days. Ah, oh, these flares go up. Interesting. The delay is really funny. Black Maze is just uh, breaking off, bitching straight down. Roger. Oh, I lost you real fast. Where did you end up going? Uh, Black Maze? Yeah. Oh, I just broke off for a sec. I had to hover. Oh, okay. I'm gonna come back on you now. From below? Uh, no, I'm, I'm miles away. I was just, I was sort of AFK. I got you. 26 clicks. We're descending back down. Hey, firm. God damn, the, the gladiator sounds gorgeous. Yeah, some of the best audio in the game. Not the guys are gonna make me go and get one. <laughs> I already love the aesthetics of it. It's just so well done. It sounds like she has that like the most constant whine noise that yeah. actually kind of is audible. That's oh, that's really nice. That's better than the hurricane. Alright, I'm gonna push up, pitch up here and try to keep us just under the clouds. It's a little abrupt, my bad. Oof. Sorry, almost hit you there. Oh, I see you streaking in, Maze. Hey, firm, just gonna have a look at where there is room. Oh, it's cool. Your trail isn't um, constant. Yeah, you guys neither. 
Huh. I think it's to do is like pressure. The clouds, or? maybe? Alright. What's my position? Where am I going? Ah, uh, looks like you got the 6 o'clock again. can't hear a thing, but... <laughs> yeah, nice. third person is loud. How are we doing on altitude? Are we still descending? Descending. Roger. Pretty harshly. Oh yeah, big time. Okay, yep. Nosing up. Alright, we're going to do a little bit of a left turn also to go towards that cloud. What kind of input can you use to uh, maintain your position down there, Maze? Is it all strafe right control? Now, yes, but now you are slightly going away from me. I'm, I'm at full power. See, I think I'm still limited. Does this mean, I'm, like, when I'm not... Now I'm closing in. You're doing about 300? Um, so what, what... Sorry, what did you mean with your question? What kind of control do I have? No, like, you know, on other ships you can use, like, um, like pitch and yaw to make small adjustments when you're in a turn, because it's really hard to maintain the perfect strafe-up angle. What can you do in the Gladiator? Is it all just little strafe adjustments to stay in position? Yes. Okay. Yes, but you've been you've been so smooth, right? Like, so, it's been so gentle that I, I hardly need to do anything. Uh, looking in third person, or not third person, but the rear view cam, I could just see the back end of your ship and it looks like mine. It looks like I'm looking at the thrusters That's in the back. Funny. So I'm too close? Like I'm closer than your... I'm in between your third, camera and your ship? Third person camera is always offset incorrectly. Yeah. It's like way behind the ship. That's funny. Oh man, these colors are so pretty. Yes, they are. Yeah, so I'm not really doing anything with my right stick. Just gentle pixel inputs for roll, maybe. Just to stay pretty. But it's all left stick. This thing is <gasps> inefficient. Fifty percent. Why does it feel? I kind of like it though. I want ships to run out quickly. We're gonna dip down altitude-wise a little bit.
I'm going to start nosing back up now. My favorite formation flying video still is of that um, uh, A-10. Do you remember that one? The A-10. Uh, not by number. Flying formation. Uh, no, the A-10, A10 is A10 for the Warthog. Yeah. Oh. I'm not sure I, I did that remember. video. They were like flying formation and it was filmed from the cockpit and then at some point they break off. Keith, you're making me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I'm making me nervous. We're in that instant boom territory again. You should be worried more about me because I'm I'm the one not using any stick, <laughs> trying to maintain this with a keyboard. <laughs> You're doing a hell of a job. All right, right turn coming up, starting to roll now. Yeah, so this is roll and straight up for me. Nothing else. It's just for losers. <laughs> Especially if you're in the gladiator. Honestly, I'm surprised that I haven't server boomed into you yet. Yeah, I. you think maybe it's just because we are so stable that we don't have as much uh, I don't know. Uh, latency? Latency is the know. wrong word. Interpolation. Yeah, I kind of want to know what happens if I actually sit on the same high altitude as you, but I don't want to ruin the fun. We are rolling level now. Uh, I think you could probably, at that distance, I think you could come up and you would be alright. Not any closer though. This feels so wrong. Looks like it's so. You always yeah. avoid it, you know? Yeah, yeah. At a real airplane, you'd be having all kinds of trouble right now. I just want to get closer now. Well, do know? it. Just do it really slow. Because the yeah, impact gonna zone's probably going to be. Right. Uh, if you do it gently enough, I don't think you will. I think we'll just tap and you'll see the sparks. Uh, not on purpose. We are gaining some altitude, though. 28. 27. I'll try to nose down just a little bit. 24. 23. Oh! oh. Get out! Oh, it's, it's red! It's, it's red! Who's red? What? On my screen, you guys are in the same area, and oh. everything is going, sparking, going crazy. What about you, Data? I'm fine. On me, you're super yeah. smooth. Yeah, we never touched on my screen. Yeah. That was wild. It only yeah, happens for a minute. Yeah, that was at 24. That was at 24. Let's get back to 24. Alright, I'm gonna right, nose down just a little bit to clear this climb. I'll just call out when I see Spark. Are you full power, Data, or what? Because I'm, I'm at full power and I'm... I'm like, thrust so limited settling. just slightly. You want me to turn it down just a little no, bit uh, more? Oh. oh! Okay, you just teleported into me and then out of me at 24 <laughs> again. I think 24 is the limit. Okay. At least I know now. All right. Well, you want to switch it up? You want? Let me. Uh, let me see how close I can get to you. Sure. All right. I'm gonna go up over you. I'm uh, reducing accelerometer. Roger. And it's flying in a straight line. Ooh. Maze has the lead. Do I tell me if I need to slow down or whatever? Because I don't usually lead. No, you're like, good I don't and know stable. If I'm too fast. Okay. Got just enough headroom. This feels so sketchy trying to gently ease it in. Yep. Let's watch them tick down real slow. Oh, coming a little quick.
That's 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh. There we go. There we go. Fine. I didn't even oh. feel that. No, That's crazy. That, so. That's crazy indeed. Pitching down slightly. Yeah, so my client probably saw me inside your ship. It was like, hey, uh, we just collided. This sort was of like, okay, you're dead. Zap. Damn. Keith's like, I want to try. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. I'm going to get behind Keith and see what happens. See if we can get a chain uh, okay. reaction going on. I'm not that stable, so be careful. <laughs> me neither. <laughs> System. All right, I'm gonna make a slight left turn toward the sun here. Your insurance claim has been sent. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Please visit us again. Your vehicle will guide to, to the ASOC vehicle and retrieval And leveling system. out. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the Please following location. Please visit us again. Goodbye. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Alright, I'm gonna bring something a little different so we can go out with the bang. Oh boy. He's dropping a bomb. He didn't say no. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna gain altitude here a bit. Get Cloud altitude. So, um, what are your thoughts on the M50 PTU? Better? Worse? I, I mean, it handles and flies better than... 317 I think I haven't done a whole lot of flying with it but with my the few times I took it around the track I think it might be a little bit too fast just in general but handling feels more controllable I'm so surprised to hear you say that man I felt like it was much more wobbly and all over the place it's different like 20 you have here. It, Sorry. It's Risky. way more active control than most of the other ships. Pitching level. Pitching level. Yeah. I'm not sure that's a bad thing. I don't know. I'll have to fly it some more. So, I feel like it allows rotating off the nose a little bit. Quite a bit. But then it resists and wobbles, like, really strangely. And then the roll does that laggy thing. So, the... The Razor also does the same barrel roll. It's just that, I guess, because it's a little more I, more aerodynamically stable, it doesn't allow the nose to yaw off the rotation like it does on the M50. Okay. Damn, look I at think that that's, sun, that's, 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 that's really the difference, is that because it's the M50 is more aerodynamically unstable, then it, it behaves... It's got that weird behavior... Sorry when you get to the edge of the yeah. uh, aerodynamic limits. Monster breaking. If it releases the way it is, I'm really curious if, um, like how the, the ships are gonna shake out now if the performance doesn't change yeah. for the uh, cup. I have, yeah, I have no idea, it'll need a good test.
You didn't hear it from me, but most likely we're doing M50s for Yadar, so that's going to be interesting. Mm. So, Data, I'm just flying, right? Like, you're going to meet us? Yes, I will meet you. I picked the wrong point to jump to and almost went to... One of the I'm other gonna do a points. looping, you guys. See if you can stay with me. I'm gonna try avoiding uh, having a pitch, so it's just strafe up. Engage. Here we go. going somewhere I don't want her to go. I think uh, at this pitch rate we might just end up in space. <laughs> I think we are. We're already uh, able to oh. quantum if yeah, we want I to. Yeah, I see you guys. Tank clicks out. Uh, I'm just gonna keep it. Over doubled our speed. Do a power down. I'm just gonna keep it, Jim. <laughs> Max speed for the Gladiator, wow, 982. I increase my uh, pitch rate here. Ah, party markers are updating so slow. Yeah, that's funny, isn't it? Oh, I'm starting to wobble. I think that the gladiators are actually faster than a Mustang, at least the Mustang Delta in atmosphere. Wow. Because I've been at full throttle the entire time and when I had to break off due to getting a bit close, I haven't been able to catch up really, and you guys got up to five kilometers away. And I'm. When I'm not boosting, I'm only gaining at 30 meters per second, 20 meters per second. You have eyes on me, Maze. Hey, firm. Twenty clicks out. Roger. Oh, it takes the bombs a long time to get down. <laughs> I 
I dropped it 20. While well, you were 20 out and it's still on its way down. Can you see the, the icon for it? Negative. No. Okay. Do you want us to form up on you? Uh, yeah. I was trying to get a camera image of this hitting the ground, but... Oh, there it goes. There it is. <laughs> Took forever. Yeah, I'm gonna do a pretty, pretty aggressive roll to the left and meet up with Data. No. Um, just do a 90 degree and the, let's do a scissor. I'll cut across you and you can go back. Hey, firm. Heading, I'm supposed to fly, but you're slow. I'll just do what I need to do. I'm I'm not that slow. I'd say start making your turn back to the right now. I just crossed you. A firm. I'm cruising at just under 300. Yep, I got you. Dropping back a little bit. Oh man, the headlights on the Gladiator have a lot of sideways reach. Or is that the Mustang? No, oh, that's a Mustang. Okay. okay. Mustang, I think. Oh, the Hurricane has, has candles. Yeah, the Hurricane's headlights are broken. Pretty sure. Ions as well. Man, the sound of those massive engines, those. That is pretty awesome. Alright, I'm Give gonna try something here. There. Yeah, I'm gonna hit boost, but I'm gonna try to roll back on the throttle so I don't accelerate. I wanna see if it changes the auto. Coming back oh, off it. The, it's like a it's like a rocket trying to get out of atmosphere. Ooh, that's that's tough making that, that transition. Rough crackle. I bet. I'm rolling back level. Alright, uh, <laughs> you wanna follow me in for a bombing run? Oh shit. Oh, hey, look at that. There's, uh, there's water down there to our right. I can see the sun reflecting off of it. Either that or I'm seeing a clip to the planet. Maybe I saw a clip to the planet. Oh. Nearly AU right there. 
All right. Uh, I guess I'll just nose down f for the dive. Starting to dive now. I wish these bombs f fell a little bit faster. Any idea what their terminal velocity is? Uh, I do not. Uh, you guys can follow it if you want. Where is it? Like, I'll, I'll test it. Is I haven't it dropped it yet. Bomb door, bay door is opening Open now. It. Oh, I see it. Oh my god, look at that thing. There's two of them. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, do not fly too close behind me because the... It's probably going to drop and then and fall out backwards. All right. Dropping in three, two, one. Bomb away. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. Thing went way behind Completely us. back. Yeah. Oh, pitching up hard. All right. Missed the target. I'm keeping on it in about it? 100 or so. Oh, wow. Look at that thing go. I at least want to just get a good view of this thing. So, don't get real yeah. close to it, but you can actually influence it with your thrusters. You can push on it, and it'll oh, make it shit, start spinning it under control. It seems to be falling at nine, like at a hundred. Okay, right. so that's, that's probably close to terminal velocity. Uh, you do not want to be within 150 meters of it when it hits the ground, because it will kill you. It killed me. Uh, oh, I guess <laughs> you ran into it. <laughs> and that killed me too. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so, okay. So, hang on. So, who who ran into it? I it hit Shredo. Apparently, it Shredo. fell into my ass. <laughs> okay. So, and then did it actually? Do a full explosion at that range? Yeah, it, like I didn't mid -air? see the uh, the the cloud, but I did yeah. see like a whole bunch of stuff fall onto the ground. So it did the full area damage. Huh? I think I was like, just me. barely out of range when it did that. Was, my ship took absolutely no damage somehow. <laughs> All right, you guys want to do a a little bit of a different test? What do we got? We are going to climb to the edge of space. And I'm going to see if I can drop it just off the edge so it has zero velocity. And then we can play hot potato. <laughs> that's, that's funny. I am going to have to run. But this was really fun. Very medita meditative. <laughs> that's what we're going to do. Alright, Maze. Uh, you you out, ended man. it in style. That's the way to go out. <laughs> I will try to post that bit later where you say, Oh, yeah, we're so oh. close. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> boom. <laughs> oh, that was too oh, good. Uh oh. Speaking of boom. <laughs> I'll post that later. Somebody. That was guys, Keith. Enjoy. All right, mate. See ya. Was that a desync collision there, Keith? Yeah, I was right behind you, like 15, maybe 20 meters away. Uh, okay. Yeah, it did nothing to me. No impact. Yeah. My turn. <laughs> I wonder, could it be that the thrust, uh, thrusters are causing the explosion, if you're too close? I think it's probably just the, the latency. We're on a US server and you're EU, right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I think I reached right. max speed. I'm gonna hop off now, I'm gonna go get my dinner. Um, it was fun, guys. Uh, oh, next oh time. shit! <laughs> no, I, I was well goes... behind you on that one. Yeah, that's probably just like a server hiccup then. Yeah. Alright, Keith, uh, thanks for flying with us. We had a lot of fun. Yeah, thanks for hey, having Keith, me. Hey, Keith, man. See you, guys. See ya. Well,
Damn it. <laughs> Did you pop on that one? Nope, no damage. No Damn, impact for okay. me. That's interesting. Oh, that's right. And now I'm in fucking... What's it called? Grim Hex. Grim Hex. Oh, because the crime's dead. Right. Yeah. Yeah, you're not going to be able to pay it off there either. That's unfortunate. Oh, uh, what fuck. level current stat is it? It's a CS2. Oh, yeah. Let me double check. But it's it's probably something like... Um, oh, what do they call it? Actually, if you open Moby Glass, it might tell you what it is. My Moby says that I have nothing. But I'm also a Grim Hex, so I'm wondering if oh, it's just true. like, Hey, you're good. Yeah. Uh, check your the uh, journal thing in the mobile glass. That might tell you. What the? This is an interesting predicament here. Uh, somehow, I have left my body behind <laughs> somewhere. I got in an elevator and hit a button and I have lost my body. Oh, you're just a camera? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a set of eyeballs floating around. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Can you still move? Like, r within a very small box. And I can clip through the doors of the elevator. But I can't use the terminal. That is weird. And my Moby Glass, like, everything goes, like, dim or whatever. Oh, I can even see, like the numbers or letters of the map but no actual visuals of the map wow this is quite unique okay we're gonna go to menu <laughs> Well, I got my bombs ready to drop right at the edge. You're like if anyone was around. <laughs> I'm coming out in a second. Roger. Roger that. Uh, I can't quantum travel to you. Um, you'll probably have to open the Moby Glass, go to the it, map, it and click the on it. Struck for some reason, that, that... Um, is it? Is it breezy? Yes. Yeah, it's because you're on the other side of the planet, so hit an OM. That's what I did. And you're still on the other side of the planet, according to your party marker. It's like just over the edge of the horizon. Going to OM1 to check.
Yeah, on one, you'll have a clear line of sight to me. Yep. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello, guys. Oh, hey, Shaggy. Hello. Is this like, um, are you guys in game doing something right now? Yeah, we're just about done. We're, uh, we're at the end of event shenanigans where we all die, basically. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. The classic, very much so. Yeah, I just, I just joined the server. Um, just looking okay. around. I saw the the amazing youtube channel the absolutely goddamn gorgeous youtube channel yeah i, I just got my host ass trust master um a couple days ago i just hopped into an m50 and i just loved it you know i was like oh shit i want to fly fast just was searching around youtube saw the videos and oh wow there's a whole ass oh nice yeah. well welcome to xgr then thank you thank you Excited to be here. So this is a uh, this is our weekly formation flight event where we basically just mm. fly really close to each other, but it's very calm and relaxed and chill. We don't do any racing, and then at the end we usually do something that ends up killing everybody because you know <laughs> that's the, that's the way to end an event. Yeah, yeah, yeah. always, hey, always. Why are you upside down? down? Following a bomb down the ground. I am upside down because. Uh, when I launch the bomb, I don't want it to fall into gravity because I'm I'm like two me two or three meters above the edge of the gravity plane. Mm. I'm Are actually not sure. Yeah, we're in live right now. Okay, good. good. Great. I'm not sure what's gonna happen when I drop these bombs. So. Uh, mm, what happens when you drop bombs? Don't they explode? Well, yeah, but I'm in, in space and zero G just at the edge of the Atmo. I'm not sure they're going to come out. It might tell me I'm, uh, yeah, no gravity. Okay, so what I'm going to have to do, this is going to be sketchy. I'm going to go into gravity and try to give myself just enough speed to break it. So, like, the bomb should come out and slow down just as it exits the, uh, the atmosphere. We'll see what happens. I'll just drop one to start. I have a question. Does anyone have like a T16000 uh, POSAS setup here? Drop. Oh, I dropped it way too fast. It falls. There it goes. <laughs> um, is it coming back down or is it good? It's in zero G. Oh, no, it's not. Oh. No, it's falling, but slowly is falling. What up? I thought it was in zero G because there's well, it no should be. altitude it... indicator. Oh but shit! Then... Oh god! Oh! I almost ran into it. I couldn't see it. Yeah, it's uh, it... it's stable. Is it floating it's just away? floating. Yeah, yeah. I had just a little bit of momentum when I when I dropped it. <clears throat> All right, so technically, if you get close to it and hit it with your thrust, it should spin it a little bit. Doesn't look like it did, though. Man, I wish I had a multi-tool with a tractor beam. If you touch it, you're dead. <laughs> Don't I bump know. it. <laughs> See, how fast do we drift in here? Oh, I think you did. You you interacted with it. It's it's moving fast now. Yeah, that definitely sped it up. Alright, I'm going to see if I can push it the other direction.
Uch. Uh, da muss ich gleich. Gotta get it lined up right in front of my retro. Oh wow, teleported. Did you guys see that? Yep. yep. Okay. There is a whole flight school. Oh my god. Oh, watch out. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Sorry. <laughs> we didn't blow up. That's impressive. This is like a whole ass like Formula oh. One style. Holy shit. All right. Going Russian there. roulette. You try to push it into me. I see that. Trying to adjust its heading. All right. Let me get a little bit closer and I'll bump it. Well, not bump it, but. All right. Um, did that move it at all? Nope. Uh, okay, so maybe it doesn't work in uh, space. Okay. Uh, damn, it's going too fast to, to get out an EVA. So, professional racer, racers fly decoupled. Uh, what the fuck? There's always an argument between people who mostly run decoupled and those who run with coupled, what but... Uh, uh, I see. Is that a Gladius oh, Scarif? Yeah, it's a bad guy. Uh, yeah. It's a NPC, it looks like. I'm gonna... If someone stays by that um, bomb, I'm gonna head to Port Tressler and get a multi-tool. Okay, yeah. I'll sit here and then, babysit it. Can, <laughs> yeah. And then... We, yeah, then we can get. Did the bomb just blow up? Nope. Nope. What up, boys? Where are you? Uh, I think it's. I don't see it on radar anymore. The bomb? No, yeah, no, the that Gladius. No, the, I killed the, the Gladius. Okay, yeah, the bomb is right in front of me. I got my headlight on it still. I'm rotating around it. <laughs> I'm a madman. Because what's the multi tool then? Oh, what the? <laughs> it shaked into me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, there's a timer on it. I don't know, but I was at least 100 meters out. I may have a timer then. <laughs> well, I mean, rip. that would be <laughs> logical that there's a timer on it. I mean, guess what happened yeah. with all the soft death, all those five, uh, all those uh, blown up A2s um, with their nukes just lying around, waiting to be poked with a stick. I don't think that the bombs are actually armed until they're dropped, so... Um, there's like a, a four or five second delay <coughs> when you drop them out. They actually don't have any collision for that time. But after they become collidable, then any kind of contact will make them explode. Hey guys, sorry I got caught up. Ah, uh, no big deal. I think we're just you about done here. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. We were uh, playing with a bomb, and uh, <laughs> died. It ended horribly. as you would expect. <laughs> <laughs> I see, I see. Oh, cool. Well, I had fun on the event. Um, that was, was a lot of fun. I'm down to do uh, any upcoming ones for next time. Yeah, every Sunday at 11 a.m. CST. I think that's 1700 UTC. Cool, cool. And the races and stuff it'll have going on. Um, you all said that it drops what 3.18. Well, we've got a community run uh, races 
Uh, if you look, I don't know if anything's actually scheduled right now. Actually, no, I'm wrong. Uh, there's a starter ship circuit that is next weekend, the 12th, or weekend after, is this at 2 o'clock. Yeah, if you look under events. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Okay, sweet. I'm gonna, I'm so just... the other two, the Stanton Cup Round 4, just got a placeholder date, So and the uh, the BTR Exhibition Terminate. Tournament also is just a placeholder. We're waiting on PTU cool. for those. Uh, how do you uh, get the student license? I would like to learn some stuff as well. Uh, so our resident teacher Shaq New is uh, at a uh, a rocket launch site right now. He works on satellites. So oh, sweet. Uh, he should be back sometime this month, and he's the one that runs the the student uh, training school. And to get a license, you basically just have to come to one of the the school events, one, one of the trainings. Uh, that's nice. that's pretty much it. All right, cool. Well, thanks for the info, and I will see you guys later. All right, take care. Later. So when's that starter trip race thing? Uh, two weekends from now, on the twelfth at two o'clock. If you look under the... if. It, Events in the XGR Discord. It's at the very top on the left. Just click on events, and it'll sh it'll show up, and it'll tell you the date and the time displayed is in your local time. So what trips are counted as a starter ship? That's called a a starter ship circuit. Because it's open to, to new people, basically. I'm not sure it's got a channel. <coughs> Doesn't look like this. Why? I have a question. Why do I, I... I just bought a new CPU. And now... Every... Even if, like, everything is fine, like, my... There's no component that's at 100% utilization. But still, like, star citizen and lags in, like, base and, you know, near planets. Why is that? That's just star citizen. Yeah, in some oh, ways it is just star citizen. What kind of uh, CPU did you get? Intel or AMD? It, so Ryzen 7, 5th generation Ryzen 7, 7500, 5700X, yes. Okay, so <clears throat> a couple I, things. It's yeah, it's a 30-40% utilization most of the time. Even at, like, low high loads, 50% being utilized. No, oh, are you getting GPU capped? I, I'm pretty sure y yes, but GPU is at 80% utilization, um, okay. 85, something like that. So if you're just talking about random stutters you get around like landing zones or space stations, I think everybody gets those, or most people mm -hmm. get them. I I definitely do. They'll, they'll come in and last for like 40 seconds and then go away. Okay. Yeah, that happens, but like, even then, uh, on... on on planets where I would like to like a race, I don't. Know. How it? much RAM do you have? Yeah. Yeah, I have 16 gigs of RAM. I think that might be limiting factor. Yeah, that that's definitely RAM. limiting. I noticed a uh, like 10 to 15 uh, FPS increase when I changed to 32 gigs of RAM. Okay. And then also make sure that your timings are are accurate. Yeah, C16, I think. Yeah. Sometimes uh, when you use um, yeah. the, 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 yeah, the XMP, yeah. yeah, 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 I know, DOCP, something, something, right? yeah, something like that. <clears throat> Can I send a request to you guys? Or are you like hopping off at right now? Uh, yeah, we're we're pretty much done. To, yeah, I was gonna switch over to a different server that it looks like a bunch of other people are playing Star Citizen. But oh, okay. I'm gonna stay I just wanna... in game. Hmm. Oh, you're gonna stay in game? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna keep playing the game, probably switch servers, though. So. Okay, okay. Got it. I was just like, I wanna do one. What's a track that you recommend a beginner do? For... Uh, Lorville Outskirts. Or Lorville, Lorville Gateways is what it's called in 317.5. Okay. It's really easy to learn. And. Yeah, and it's right outside Lorville, so you can just set your spawn to Everest Harbor, and it takes like a minute to get back. Hmm. 
Uh, do you know the XGR website, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm just hopping over onto that to see, like, yeah. get the data on the track. Our stream, that does it for this week. Be back next week, 11 o'clock. See you.